new construction mar vista 2022 quarter one we're taking a look right now in the special edition to see whether or not the new construction market is just as fierce and hot as what we're experiencing here in the regular mar vista market in 2022 so by the end of this video you're going to completely understand if buyer demand is just as ever present for new construction as well as whether or not sellers are getting above and beyond the asking price so stay tuned in we're about to jump into it and give you a complete picture of what new construction looks like now and where it's going in 2022. What's up and welcome. Hope you guys are doing absolutely fantastic this weekend. If you're celebrating Easter, happy Easter to you. And we're about to jump into this special edition video where we're talking about Mar Vista, 2022 quarter one new and newer construction so you as a buyer and seller completely understand what's going on but before we jump into it if you haven't been here before i'm eric haas with exp realty i'm a real estate agent here on the west side of los angeles and i'm just here to drop the truth on what's going on with this real estate market so you as a buyer and seller can make the best decision possible when either buying or selling your home now we've also got tips and tricks that usually are found at the end of the video so make sure you stick around to the end and if you haven't already, please like, subscribe, and comment. Comments are everything, especially if you have a specific question. I'm here to help, whether it's on screen or off screen. As again, I'm a 24-7 real estate agent, and I'm all about helping you. So let's get on into Mar Vista, new and newer construction for 2022, quarter one, and where it's going. Before we jump into these numbers right here for quarter one and quarter four and seeing how they compare for new and newer construction here in Mar Vista, it's important to understand what new and newer construction really is in Mar Vista and Los Angeles compared to say, Texas, Florida, and the other states that have just an expansive amount of land still available. New construction and newer construction here in Mar Vista is one home at a time, whereas Texas, Florida, we're looking at you know multiple homes, big developments, model homes that's just not the case here in la especially here on the west side in mar vista venice santa monica brantwood or palisades even malibu for that matter these are all spec homes purchased one at a time and being torn down and being built brand new so a little bit of a difference between what happens here in los angeles versus say those grand new developments that are occurring in florida and texas but let's get into these numbers as you see right now we don't have much for quarter four we're going to change it up as we move forward into the new year the quarter one 2022 right now we only have two listings available for sale there are six under contract and similar to the current regular market of mar vista the number of solds are actually down 50 percent from 18 in quarter four to nine in quarter one now what does that mean it means that inventory is absolutely tight still with only two available for sale not to mention how many actually sell off market yes friends most of these homes that are being built brand new are actually being scooped up by buyers driving around the neighborhood looking for new construction and that's the way to do it right now and then they can get in contact with the agent who signs us up or find who the builder is and get that off-market deal and into their dream home at the end of the day so tip number one for buyers look at these new construction homes that are being built because majority of them have the opportunity to be purchased right now now having a look at what's next the median active the median pending and the median sold it's pretty crazy what is happening here in mar vista because let me tell you in 2014 yours truly right here sold the very first three million dollar home in mar vista it took 24 hours but we got it done and we actually sold over the asking price now we're looking at what the median active price is and the median active price is sitting at four million same with the median pending price at four million and the median sold price is actually up eight percent from 3.5 million to almost 3.8 million right now so what does that tell us about what's going on in mar vista's new and newer construction market well, it's stupid hot right now, and it's only going to continue to be the same way. So especially if you're thinking about buying new construction and it hasn't been built yet, get in touch with me. I have a connection with all the builders that are building in the neighborhood right now, and I can give you a full list of what is transpiring and what's coming based on your budget as well. But as you can see here, I mean, the median pending is actually supporting 
our median active price right at four million which again as you don't remember maybe you didn't see the first video where we covered mar vista as a whole but this is actually the indicator of where values are going to be going as we move further into 2022 as we move further into quarter two as we move forward into spring and summer markets for that matter as well so only expect values to rise so sellers be smart about your pricing because let me tell you you can do amazing with most of these homes right here that are selling in quarter one for new and newer construction going over the asking price as we'll get to in a minute as we keep moving forward and seeing exactly what these numbers really mean for you as a buyer and seller we're going to look at the average days on market the sold volume as well as the sold price versus the original list price and right off the bat you're going to see a huge drop in the average days on market from 22 to 15. i mean that's almost 50 percent right there and that just goes to show you that buyer demand for these new and newer constructions homes is just off the charts there's still just an insatiable amount of demand for these new and newer construction homes and why well they're not being built in like these big developments like we're seeing in texas and florida as i mentioned before it's one by one by one and let me tell you permits for these things sometimes take you know three to four or five months and then you've got to build the thing so a lot of these things are not even coming to market for an entire year and that's why you as a buyer need to be on the hunt for them in the neighborhood that you're looking for so you can take advantage and get these properties before they even hit the market before you have to compete and a lot of the times a really cool thing is if you get in early you have the opportunity to work with the builder and be able to have your own personal touches put into the home now let's look at these numbers again sold volume is down almost 50 percent as well from 67 million to 37 million it's only going to get harder to find new and newer construction in mar vista and our sold price versus the original price wow it has just gone up significantly i mean we were at 101 percent for quarter four it's not changing and we're up five percent to 106 percent right now of sellers getting the ass asking and over the asking price and it's not just fifty thousand; it's hundreds of thousands and now it's time for my favorite slide as we see exactly how many homes sold over the asking price how many homes sold at the asking price and how many unfortunate sellers sold under the asking price at the end of the day because that is still happening even in this hot sellers market even when demand is so crazy fierce for this new and newer construction properties here in mar vista but you got to be on point with your price and as we can see majority of the homes in quarter one and quarter four went over the asking price as far as at the asking we had two and we had one so a lot of those homes probably were purchased off market and just put on the mls just for comp purposes now if we look at the number of homes that went under the asking price it dropped 80 percent from seven selling under the asking price in quarter four to only one single home in mar vista selling under the asking price new newer construction it's mind-boggling everything is selling and selling quick especially if that price is on point and that's even if it gets to the market so sellers tips for you guys right now right here if you're a builder selling new construction or a homeowner with newer construction we're talking 2010 or newer you are in a prime position but don't mess it up messing it up involves overpricing it there's no such thing as underpricing in this market right now take advantage of it and you will see it pay dividends for you in the end that's the best advice i can give sellers right now in this crazy market you've got to be mindful of your price buyers out there you are in a little different position obviously if it comes to market you're going to have all the eyes on it so be very mindful of driving around the neighborhoods you love this is the most important tip i can give you is that you need to be looking for things off market you need to be going directly to whoever is building the home so that you have the opportunity to purchase it not have competition when purchasing it and then be able to add your own personal touch at the end of the day so guys this is the end of the video i'm so stoked that you are here we're going to be dropping this as well for venice brentwood and santa monica i know that venice market update was supposed to come this weekend but i hope you enjoyed this new and newer construction perspective because it's a lot different than what just our regular market is doing here in mar vista but from the standpoint of buyer demand it is just as on fire so hope you have a blessed weekend enjoy your easter don't eat too much and i will see you next week take it easy